Give me my crackers. The breakfast of champions right there. Look at that morning. Look at that fog. Beautiful. We need to, um, we need to get a board game for board game day. We do. Mm -hmm. We have to figure out what that is. I burn chess. <laughs> I challenge you to a chess match. My backpack is like the size of that barn door. Everybody's like, whoa. That's probably not the game you want to bring, although it would be fun to see you dominate all your friends in chess. Ooh, 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 ooh. Hey, Andrew. He beats me. Da -da -da -da. <laughs> you have somebody sitting here beside you, I noticed. <laughs> Who is this guy? Tom Tom. Do you know I have a box out right out there right now? In fact, you may be able to see it. I see it. It has something inside of it. <laughs> it's very much related to this guy right here. In fact, I think now would be a great time to, uh, to open that. Ooh, yeah. After you eat those crackers. Yeah. It's rather light, Clark, man. Feels, I don't know. I didn't finish my crackers yet. Your cracker eating is causing confusion and delay. I know Clark, what man. it is. What? It's some new town of strength. Can't be. Never heard of them before. What's the big plan for today outside of bringing a board game in? Playing board games. Hoping this bird fell back. <laughs> so you can be over in the other classroom? Yes, playing a game with Patrick. Oh. Best buddy. <laughs> Maybe next year you guys will be in the same class. I hope so. First grade, I wish he was in the class. But if it was somebody else. You guys are like the dynamic duo at the school, huh? Yeah, he has the best teacher ever. Because <laughs> she has snack time? <laughs> that, n n literally my days there are just the best how could a first grade teacher not have snack time that's what kids live for no, we're always in their rush to try to get science and stuff they don't even do science really yeah what have you guys been doing in science i know you said you started it what was your last assignment you did uh last time Miss bear was there at school what did you guys do um, did something, but quite remember. Did you guys have uh, beakers and Bunsen burners and stuff like that? <laughs> Combining no. dangerous chemicals together? No. Making smoke bombs? No, that's what I want. That's what I pretty much want to do. You get to high school, mm -hmm. you'll get to do it. Yeah. You should make a chemical that makes your hair not stand up like that. That'd be amazing. I, I might Invent make, it. I might make a chemical. It grows your hair back. Please. No. Please do it, Clark. I need you, boy. I will do it for you. You're getting creeped on right now because you have one of her favorite ingredients in the world. <laughs> and it's not crackers. She's like, please, sir, have some mercy for a starving dog. I haven't eaten in over 35 minutes. I'm very, very hungry, sir. Look at my body. It's wasting away. <laughs> <laughs> you at least ate your peanut butter. That's all I need. Just a little oh, bit of peanut butter. No, <laughs> she's getting underneath the plate. You, you never know. Right, there's no, there's nothing more. I did a little bit of cheater cuts on there to open it up for you, to help you. <laughs> What'd you get? I knew you were, I knew you were gonna replace me. <laughs> I know I I knew and it's going to probably need a little bit of uh, encouragement to come out of there. But we got the Thomas Wooden Railway. New Thomas with the cheeky face. The first Thomas Wooden was, engine in a very long time. Do you see his cheeky face? Oh, snap. Yeah. Look, the wheels are different. We'll do a full comparison here. Let me see if I can get him out of here. I think that's, he's like bound in there a little bit. So we have to take apart this box, which is sad because this box is so cute. Doesn't it look like it's made of wood? Yeah. See that? It's like branded and stuff, but it, it's just cardboard. And we probably aren't gonna save it because he's <laughs> gonna go into the collection. Thank you, Trains are for convincing us to, to buy this. I'm gonna cut into the side here and see if we can get him out of his uh, cardboard prison here and become a part of our collection. That's how they got him in there. How dare they? I'm gonna need some scissors. There he is. Look at that little devil. Let's do a comparison between old Thomas. <laughs> he's, he's scared. Which one do you guys prefer? 
this one that looks like he just saw some ghosts or this one that maybe he just told a joke and he's seeing if he laughed at it or not. Get some different angles on these guys. There's the back. Look at the little chips on old Thomas. He's been through some things. New Thomas, brand new. The wheels, very much detailed compared to the old one there. I like the new one quite a bit. You can tell that's what happened. He's looking that way because he just pushed the other Thomas off the table and he's like, Hurr. let's go see how he works on some actual track. I can run on the whole track if you want to. Right now I have a wind train. This is for like what I get on the couch and roll around on that rail. Might as well get these out of the way. All right. Let's see how he does. New Thomas coming through. Around BB-8. Right around BB-8. Around the corner. Ooh. Yeah. On to whole new tracks. Mm -hmm. And new destinations. He goes around everything he rode on. He goes right back to you. Uh-oh. <laughs> Doosh. Now he looks rather angry. Mm -hmm. Where's the rest of my track, Clark, man? Mm -hmm. You have all these tracks. I think there's something great that I should do. Make her up so tall it goes all the way up on top of my fan. That'd be amazing. And circles around up there, and then it comes all the way back down here like a drop thing, and it lands right on its wheels on the track. Sounds like you got your weekend planned. <laughs> <laughs> so, review on the new Thomas Wooden Railway. You like them? Yeah. I'm glad you do, because James is on the way, too. <laughs> it would be, be better because he has a tender. Yeah, apparently James is a little more popular. Uh, and he's back ordered, and he was a lot more money than what Thomas was. This was only, well, I shouldn't say only because it's maybe expensive. Uh, he's fifteen dollars if you're thinking about getting. I, I got Andy and Clarabelle uh, too. You do? Yeah, they're all buried and stuff in there. Uh oh, get some more light in here so we can actually see. Woo! I also have Gordon's train cart. I think we're gonna need some more wooden track out here if we're gonna pull this off. I see uh, R two D two inside your fort, Clark man. I know. I said, sure, go ahead. Clark and I have been getting into uh, trains a little bit lately. Not just wooden. I mean, this is a, it's a part of it. But um, we're getting into it a little. Clarabelle's right there. I need to find Annie. We got Clarabelle. I'm trying to hold this up so it doesn't Where collapse on Clark and <laughs> kill him. Where are you? I swore. I swore. Hey, I told you, you're causing confusion and delay. <laughs> <laughs> Clark! It's Annie. Annie! Finally got her. Finally. We got Annie and Clarabelle hooked up. Looking sweet. James, you stay away, no. fishy James. <laughs> that, that's the only dreams I have. For now. <laughs> Cheeky Thomas. That's what we're calling him. With Annie and Clarabelle. Looking pretty darn good. <laughs> These trains are bullies. Or is it the person driving them? I got pushed off the track. I'll never be accepted into this group of ragtag misfits. That's some that, crazy faces. That, that's huh? her face. <laughs> She's a uh, really. See, I didn't know that they went like that, where Annie was looking forward and Clarabelle's looking back, but that makes sense, I guess. Yeah, so they're not standing right in their faces. You ready to do a speed test? Yeah. You better move back. Three, two, one. Zing! <laughs> Can I have a go? Can I have a go? <laughs> <laughs> I went really far back time. I love these train tracks. I'm so glad this is a hobby that you got into and still enjoy because it's so much fun. And there's so much to collect. This is the only official piece of wooden railway that we have, isn't it? Ones like this, I think, have the, the stripes on them. Yeah. 
Yeah, I like this. This isn't real. Like, tons of They're all compatible, Th though. This is for, like, our train table. Oh, is it? Yeah. Our train table that is now a Lego table? Yeah, yeah which is now Minecraft. That should be where our HO scale layout goes. Oh, no. Can we put a train track around Minecraft World? We just move everything in a little bit and oh, then have a train going around. We could have, like, a sub like support here that could go around the table. That's a great idea. Um, what if we had... We build platforms mm -hmm. up, and then the train runs around the top. It'd be cool if we had, like, if we found, like, an HO scale monorail and had it going around Minecraft world. Have it go up like this over the Ender Dragon. We build the first ever Minecraft train station, <laughs> where all the Minecraft hey. zombies and creepers can get on the train. Creepers are getting on the train <laughs> when they get angry at people for... for Reading newspapers next to them when they're trying to sleep, they blow up the train. Oh my gosh. Whoa. Watch out, Thomas! <laughs> He's brand new! <laughs> I'm crushed. <laughs> I'm crushed. He's lived I'm a crushed. really rough life so far in Why the we're up here? 15 minutes. Yeah, you should probably get ready for school because you got to go no, do that. No, I'm not talking about that. Oh, you got to pick your board game. Yeah. There's something up here you told me to save. Oh, yeah. You told me to save that little Thomas. Yeah, we got this sent to us in the mail and we have. Uh -huh. We have one already. Yeah, and the same thing for this one, too. Maybe these would be collector's items someday. The original Thomas. I, I told you you used to be green, Dad. Put him in the shed over here. <laughs> no one will ever know. What game are we taking here, boss? <laughs> you should take Operation. That's a fun one. I do an Operation on Andrew. <laughs> um, Perfection would be a classic there as well. That's the one that has, that, I think, that a pop That game's up. missing some things. That was from a yard sale. That doesn't matter. They're gonna be, by the time you leave today, it's gonna be missing even more stuff, probably. Let's guess who. That's the one where you have the pictures that all stand up, and you gotta ask the person um, if they look like a certain thing. And... Oh, guess who might be a good game. Plus, it's lightweight, so you can carry it with you. Yeah, That'd guess cool. who. It's may or may not work. <gasps> Oh, it actually fits. I'll keep it in the bag in case you need to take it out for anything. So, it around here. You have a whole board game in your backpack. <laughs> They're like, what is that thing in your backpack? It's so huge. You're like, guess who? They're like, uh, Abraham Lincoln. No, it's guess who? Um, George Washington. No, it's guess who? Why would they guess George Washington? Because you say guess who, and they don't understand that it's a game. That's the joke. That's the, that's what makes it funny. But you have to be like, it's the game guess who. That's what you have to say, yeah. yeah. You have to be very specific when you tell people things. Yeah. It's the game, the board game famously known as guess who. Abraham Lincoln. <laughs> when it's Friday. Oh, wow. <laughs> Imagine the bus pulled into your driveway and then it picked you up and then it would drive out of your driveway. It would pack it up and everything. Love you. Have a great day. We'll play tonight when you get home.